going on. So apparently in Wilmington, North Carolina, there were three racist cops that got fired because their rhetoric came up and they were actually a couple of them were talking about we should go back four or five generations and get slavery back. And they actually was caught saying that. And this happened in light of two Confederate statues coming down. You see, when you point the obvious out, no matter where you are, it's known for what it is. But see, the interesting thing is in the Dirty South, this has always been a recurring theme. That's how they really think. You have to ask yourself, who would part their mouth to say such a thing in the 21st century in 2020? But they would revive that. That has been going on for way too long. That white privilege, that entitlement, and that built-up pent-up hate, which is real. A lot of people don't like to hear the truth. But the truth, as they say, shall set you free. And I'm gratefully that those three racist trash cops got or let go from the Wilmington, North Carolina Police Department because that's the kind of hate and cover-up conspiracy that goes on where they could do some real dirty, foul stuff and no one would say nothing or know nothing because it was covered up. But this is just another in a long line of what we deal with out here all the time. Between their words, their actions, and the deed, it's all systematic, all institutionalized racism. So systemic. All of it is all connected. And no matter how you try to spin it or roll it, this is what a lot of them think. And how do you eradicate, how do you erode, how do you take that out? Well, you got to weed it out. Then they offer them jobs and process. They need to find out the truth. Are you here to do a job? Or are you here to kill black folks? Because which one is it? Because that's what it ends up basically coming down to. And it's this built-in hate where we're American citizens. I'm sorry. They just don't get it. They never have, never will. You know, you don't want us here. Give the reparations. Give an apology and put us to a place where we can go. But black folks belong here. Black folks got much stake in this country. So as far as the Confederate statues come down, they all need to come down. It's an insult to the intelligence. You cannot have a prosperous future when you're allowing yourself to sit in debris from the past. And that has no place at all. That doesn't need to be showcased in no shrine. It needs to be showcased in a dumpster somewhere. All them statues need to come down, rewrite history the right way and not the white way. All right. That's my thoughts and takes on the Wimbledon, North Carolina, three racist cops got fired and Confederate confederate statues coming down. You give me your thoughts and your takes. Hit that like it. Subscribe to the bell. Rings a new video. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for one another. And if you don't write history the right way, it will stay the white way. I'm out.